paying everybody, you know you can't fix stupid. And if anybody knows, if people that are stupid, they know Darwin's law will finally take care of them eventually. So you notice here, I'm in the second section of um, Crosswind. I'm in the second communicator, and all three of my teammates have died. It seems they have a problem trying to shut off that communicator. They get down in the box, and they all die right away. So it's going to be up to me to drop down there and take care of it. I'll do it in a minute. Now, as everybody knows, every time we go to a different season, we boot it back to level 55 or 56, and it's a pain in my ass to boot back up. So I like to use special operations because it does it quickly. I use Headhunter, Crosswind, Kubalda, and Strongbox. Now, here I am here. I'll drop in since they don't know how to do it, the second scramble. They got the first one. Communicator, excuse me. I keep changing the names of these computers. So just simply get behind it. You used to be able to do it from the prone position. Now you got to go up on your knees in a kneeling position, and you can activate it. But once you do that, stay there, because for some reason the AI does not sense you. Now here at the end of it, you know when you leave, you're going to get a shot down unless the team's with you to help clean out the box. It doesn't matter because you have five minutes to get to that to get to that aircraft. Now, and only when you go down to respawn, you're only down one minute. So I got four minutes once I respawn the parachute to the aircraft. So it's very simple. It's nothing to get killed after you get the, that second communicator. Now here I am spectating my teammate. He goes down pretty quickly. I had one teammate that would help me. The other two, I never really saw. Him. So we got two pretty bad open line teammates. Nobody is mic'd up. Everybody's running in circles, so it's a good open lobby game. I've got a lot of kills here, maybe 90, because I put up my sensor gun. But I've noticed something funny here. There's no quad bikes. There's one there that's going on it, but there's no quad bikes. Usually there's a half a dozen quad bikes. Something's very strange. So hopefully the game isn't glitching. Now still, I'm in control, and I'm going to get my points so I can rank up. So even though it's an open lobby team, probably kids, it doesn't matter. If I can swing it by myself, I have two juggernauts left. I use one in the plane cabin and one in the final push through the boneyard. So, okay, still doing okay for open lobby teams. I don't even bother trying to talk to them. I've given up long ago. So our next step is to get right here in the plane. Everybody's pretty much doing it. We made it. Now this guy here seems pretty happy shooting his gun. I would suggest you save your bullets. All right, so I got my first suit on. I'm going to play as a juggernaut. I always go down the left aisle because that's where all the heat is. I will not make it. They will shoot that suit off of me. But it gets, gets me a lot of kills, and that's why I'm playing this, for points. Usually on the left side, a couple in the center of the last cabin. Be one on the right. There he is right there. All right, time to, to put C4 in the door. Plenty of time yet. We got two minutes. I'm trying to get me a fresh belt because I'm going to need it. Here's a tip. Don't fight the juggernaut. Just run around him. He's useless. Shoot in the doorway. I always shoot to the right and center of this room because usually it used to be bots. You will switch the bots around on you. All right, now here's the core. Now watch, I'll get this guy eventually. I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna grab the core because now I know what to do with the core. Usually everybody doesn't want to grab it because then they can't shoot. I know what to do with it now. I'm getting ready to show you. All right, now here he is, my one buddy. This pretty good, but he's not realizing to open the door. When you're holding that core, you can also open the door at the same time. So if you have nuclear core, your teammates don't know what they're doing, you can open the door. Now here, this is very important. When you first come into the landing zone, you stay right here over the first part. Here's the boneyard. There's the symbol. Once you see that symbol, you can take the, co the core south. On the left side, the southeast side, and I should have no bots shooting at me. 
Sometimes I can pierce you farther, sometimes lesser. It doesn't matter. You know, it's nobody shooting me. So I'm still in control of the game. I've got the core, and I'm going to get it to the expo pad. And I've got one more juggernaut suit to get ready to see me use it. The AI is getting smart. The second I drop that core, it keys on me. So I flip to the suit, and I kill the hind. Now all I do is play defense on the helo pad and wait for the chopper to come down, the x chopper. That's a perfect place for the core. That's the first juggernaut. Down he goes. So here's where my trouble starts. So I kick out of it, grab the nuclear core, just simply go and sit in the helicopter. Now the other side of me, there are glitches and you can't shoot. And suddenly, I can not only shoot, I can't change my weapons. So if you sit there and you can't shoot or change your weapons, you're going to get booted for inactivity. That's the least of my problems. And as you notice, I'm trying to flip weapons into my to my, from my pilot to my LMG. Nothing's working. Now, where's my teammates? All three of them are running around shooting bots. They have no idea what the x is. They have no idea that they're limited, that we will get disconnected from the server if we don't finish this mission. So here I am. I'm stuck in limbo. I can't kill anything, and my teammates are running around in circles. And you know what's going to happen. We're going to get disconnected. So that's what I say, you can't fix stupid. See them right there on the right hand side? They're just circling around, shooting bots, having a ball. They don't have a clue. And some, hopefully it doesn't happen again, but when I waste all this time to get all these points to rank up, and I get booted, we lose it all. And for that reason, guys and girls, you just can't fix stupid. You can't. Eventually Darwin's Law will take care of them. I'll see you guys next video.